Okay, in this example, we want to find a data value given a specific percentile. Um, so let's look at the example of men's height. So the mean height of men in the United States is 70 inches with a standard deviation of 3 inches. Okay, so we want to find what height is represented by the 10th percentile. Okay, so essentially what we have to do is we need to take the percentile Excuse my handwriting, it looks terrible. Um, and then convert that to a z score. And then convert that to an x value. Now, the percentiles will always represent area under the normal curve. Okay? So we're going to take the area and then convert it to a z score and then convert it to an x value. So let's look at uh, this graph here. So we're assuming that the um, heights are normally distributed so the mean is going to be 70 and the standard deviation is going to be 3 okay so we're essentially looking for something that has let's say that's 10 percent or 0.1 so what we're looking for is the z-score for that value right there. Okay, so we want to know what z is here. Now the way we're going to do that is we're going to use the inv norm function on our calculator. And you just put in 0.1. Okay. So the z-score is negative 1.282. Okay. Then from that we want to find the x value. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to use the formula that x is equal to mu plus sigma times z or z times sigma okay all right so x is equal to mu in this case is 70 sigma is 3 and z is negative 1.282 okay so we just do 70 plus 3 times negative 1.282 so x is equal to 66.154 inches. So um, people that are 66.154 inches are in the 10th percentile, which means they are taller than 10% of the men in the United States. Okay. Uh, so let's try this one. We want to do the first quartile, where the first quartile is represented by the 25%. So essentially we want to find the z-score that corresponds to 0.25. Okay, so we're going to do um, INV norm 0.25 and that'll give us our z-score. And then we just need to use the formula up here to find our x. So it's just going to be 70 plus 3 times negative 0.674. So 70 plus 3 times negative 0.674. Okay. So x is equal to 67.97. Inches. So that means um, men who are 67.978 inches are taller than 25% of uh, other men in America.